away from the PC Friars taking on defending national champion Minnesota Duluth in the Frozen Four. Providence getting into practice and some media today at Key Bank Stadium. That's where we find our own Ruthie Polensky live in Buffalo. Ruthie. Hey, Yanni, yeah, welcome to the Key Bank Center in Buffalo, where, of course, the lights just went off right before my live shot. It's so perfect. But, yes, the PC Friars making it here to the Frozen Four, despite being the four seed in their region. And that's just one of the similarities between this team and the 2015 team that won it all. Nate Lehman's not complaining about any of those similarities. It's, uh, it's been a fun ride all, all season, and I think this is, this is what it all come, comes down to. So it's... Uh, it's a great honor to be here, but uh, we got to make sure that we're ready to play. Providence College, one of the final four teams left in college hockey, a feat they didn't know would be a possibility just a few weeks ago. We knew we still had a chance, and uh, it would be something special if we were able to get in that tournament, and we did. So I think the guys kind of realized themselves, and then with Coach Lehman helping that, he just he kind of propelled us over the edge there. Lehman hopes his familiarity on this stage will benefit his group. One that reminds him a lot of the team he coached five years ago, a team that took home the national title. We didn't develop the chip on our shoulder, the desperation we needed until uh, until the tournament. And I thought that I thought the same way with uh, the 2015 team. There are also similarities between this team and the team they'll face on Thursday night. You know, there's not a big difference, you know, between the teams. I think it's going to come down a lot to to will and want and desire and who who can influence uh, who can influence their game on the other team and in specialty teams. And Yanni, this was funny. Casper Bjorkwist was asked when this PC Friars team is most comfortable on the ice. And he jokingly responded, when we're down 3 nothing." Now what I took away from that, and what I think he meant by that, is that this team's really seen it all this year. And as of late, they've found ways to win no matter what situation they're in. So that'll all be put to the test this weekend. Live in Buffalo tonight, I'm Ruthie Polinski, Eyewitness Sports.